yeah. Undertaker, The Last Ride. Uh, well, th- this was a fun fun little documentary. I thought it was fantastic. It was uh, it was definitely well shot. My girlfriend thought it was fantastic as just an outsider. She just loved it. And I think by doing that, they've achieved what they were attempting to with the, the whole um, association with Michael Jordan's Last Dance. Yeah, I've been watching that, actually, and I'm not even a big fan of basketball, but that is... That is amazing. I haven't watched it. I've heard great things about it. But I think they achieved the same sort of thing with this, where they get people that don't necessarily know anything about the product at all to get invested in somebody's story. Yeah, and I really think they've managed to uh, save face with him. The whole idea that they never wanted to show the behind the curtain of Taker throughout his entire career. They want to ruin the character. But I think even... With that in mind, you still haven't ruined the character by showing just how, I guess, old school and hardcore dedicated he is to the business and to the character. This made me really think about the current breed of wrestler. Undertaker has spent 30 years being the Undertaker, and it's only now, as his career, he knows his career is winding down, that he chooses the cameras to film him as Mark Calloway. And it, it really separates itself from, like, evil Uno, who I still can't get over posted a wish list of things that he wanted to do in the next 10 years in his in his career one of which was have a video game stream <laughs> well, how I... am i supposed to take the guy seriously he's he wants to stream video games and that's something that he aspires to do that's the highlight of his career is it no, that's something that he had on his on his checklist that he hadn't done yet that he wanted to do in the next 10 years that's... yeah that's been done. Xavier Woods has done that gimmick. It's no one else can do it like him now. It seems like literally every wrestler's got a twitch. Yeah, but it's his thing, you know. He he started it. He's known for it. Nobody can get to the same level as him, I don't think. Oh, definitely, definitely. I think Xavier Wood has made himself a career for when he retires. But the the point I'm making is, you're not going to see Undertaker on on a fucking video game streaming streaming site. You're not gonna yeah. you're not gonna see it and you're not gonna see Mark Calloway. You know what Mark Calloway does? Mark Calloway sits in his chair wearing all right Republican gear, waiting for the next person to beat up. Mark Calloway is the Undertaker. The Undertaker is Mark Calloway. And living the gimmick as old school as that and showing respect to the business that he's in really stood out for me in comparison to most of the wrestling talent around at the moment who see it as their professional job. And it, there's a big, I can see a big, big difference between the old school, which are dying and dead and dying off like The Undertaker and, uh, you know, a tray from Impact. It, it did stick out to me as well, that different worlds we live in now. But do you think that's because of the culture we live in? The wrestlers can't just be their gimmicks anymore. They have to, they have to do this more self-promotion, which The Undertaker didn't have to do. I do agree with that. I think, it would be quite difficult for The Undertaker to have a Twitter account. And if he doesn't have a Twitter account in 2020, then he's less noticeable than people that do have a Twitter account. I would say that if you have a certain character, I'm speaking more to the heels than the baby faces. You need to be the heel on Twitter. You say that it's harder now than it was before. And with The Undertaker having a sort of supernatural gimmick, I, I don't, I'm not sure he could pull it off in the same way now. But just look at MJF for social media use. MJF is never not MJF. He doesn't care about doing video game streamings. He calls out the Mountain Dew nerd sitting in their mum's basement for doing a video game stream. Then you've got Evil Uno, who's supposed to be a heel, saying that that's on his wish list. Who do you prefer? Who do you think's cooler? Yeah, that's what I said last week with MGF. The bad guys shouldn't be scared to be heels outside on social media, but out outside of outside of the the shows. They should continue yeah. their character, and that really gets them over even more as just being these dickhead heels that you you want to boo. It adds I, to the character. I do think there's a middle line. I'm not saying that everybody should go be the taker at this documentary. Um, and I don't think you can live the gimmick as much as you used to be able to. But you should always be on the gimmick, I think. It makes the most money. If if nothing else than just making making money, that, that's all you care about, then you're going to make more money from being the gimmick whenever you're in social presence. Like, MJF might well have a video game streaming site in his spare time. Nobody knows. He might, he might do it privately under an anonymous username, but he's not publicizing it. What this documentary showed me most clearly is that The Undertaker, above all, respects the audience, which is why I think that he's 
had such a successful career. Well, so right at the beginning, you got Mick Foley, Ric Flair, and Bret Hart, and they are all talking about Undertaker as the character. And the three of them generally say that he is the character, and I, I've heard this from wrestlers before, that the best personas are your true self amped to 100. Yeah. So although he's got the supernatural stuff, he even says that he's never really faking anything. He is him, although he can't rise from the dead and he doesn't have lightning bolt power. He's still playing him, which is added to the longevity of the character. And he said that less is more when it comes to the character work, which probably with Twitter, it's hard to do less and get over more nowadays than it was back in the 90s. True. 